religious experience. They prepared extensively with ceremonial rituals such as the war dance. These war dances were carried out in a specific manner involving dancing in a circle, chanting, and the beating of drums. The Iroquois were resourceful and used their hunting weapons and techniques in battle. Not only were they the masters of these tools, but they were prepared to fight with only a moment's notice. Devastating loss of population, Iroquois warriors embarked on a mourning war. Members of enemy tribes were taken captive and were integrated into the Iroquois tribe. Not only was this a means for tribe members to mourn the recently deceased, but it was also a way to restore lost population and to ensure social continuity. <laughs> The Iroquois relied on ambushes and the element of surprise. They were also unwilling to fight when greatly outnumbered and avoided a frontal assault when approaching fortified strongholds. Guns offered armor-piercing power and allowed natives to kill at a longer range. It is estimated that a native could fire 20 arrows before a musket could be loaded.